How to get the most out of coaching. Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to review the book How to get the most out of your coaching written by Karen Davis and Alex Mel. Now initially this is a book meant for coaching clients, but I advise it to every writer coach, whether you are a starter or an advanced writing coach. Indeed, this is a simple and easy read that will allow you to put yourself in the shoes of your coaching client, to better understand what their uncertainties, doubts or questions might be before you even get on that first introduction call, for example. So the first thing I really liked about this book is that it explains exactly what is the coaching for so many coaches to around the world, such as if you want to work with me, you have to be coachable. Yes, but what does coachable exactly mean? Many writers have never been in contact with a coach and they might be willing, for example, to really write that book and to get start up and running, but they might not know what exactly that coaching journey might entail. What is expected from them? What is not expected from a coach, for example? A second aspect that I liked of the book is that they pinpoint the risk of coaching and what can happen during a coaching appointment that should not take place. For example, they talk about derailment. We have all had the situation where we had a chat with a friend, for example, and suddenly that person goes off on a rant or shares inappropriate information with you. The same can happen in a coaching uh, relationship, especially when we're having this relationship between a writer coach and a writer. We know that writing a book can be something very sensitive and maybe potentially some personal stories can come up. This book will warn both the client and the writer coach how to deal with the situation how to maybe cut off or maybe put a limit when you see that the writer is sharing too much personal information with you, for example. The book is the practical advice they give to the client on how to set up a successful coaching relationship. And that is again a chapter that is very useful for you as a writing coach. For example, when will you be available for your coaching client? When can he or she contact you? through which ways, phone, email, WhatsApp, etc., etc. And this might be questions you have not thought about before you get engaged in a coaching relationship. But thanks to this book, you do not have any excuse anymore to not think about those practices. In short, I think this is a great read if you are a book writing coach because it gives you practical, easy and simple tips to set up a great relationship. It is a great book to advise to your clients, especially if the coaching client you have in front of you has never worked with a coach beforehand. This book review has been useful for you. I would love to have your feedback. If you want to share any other tips or advice on books, feel free to join me at my business clinic. It's a free Q&A session for writing coaches such as you to get unstuck in your writing coaching business. They take place every last Tuesday of the month at GMT plus eight. To sign up, nothing more simple than to click on the link below this video. I wish you a pretty day and hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.